guys it's lucia welcome back i have like early morning voice i haven't even had water yet and it's lucia welcome back to my youtube channel i thought it would be fun to show you guys my morning routine specifically my winter morning routine because it definitely changes based on the season and kind of you know what i have going on like my schedule also if you're new here i'm 23 i live in chicago and i work a nine to five in marketing and right now i am basically fully remote because no one goes into the office especially during the winter so my winter morning routine is kind of centered around working remotely but if you work in an office there's definitely parts and bits you can take i feel like with these routine videos routines are very specific to individuals so just take whatever you want for your own routine or this can also just be for entertainment i love mornings i feel like the past couple years have turned me into a morning person because i've gotten into coffee and skincare i just put on these eye patches which really help energize my eyes literally on the packaging it says it's like an energy drink for your eyes i'm excited to show you guys more in depth i know in every vlog i kind of do a morning montage but i thought it'd be fun to like explain more in depth what my morning routine is any of the products i will link down below and it's going to be a great morning subscribe for a new vlog every sunday and wednesday and let's take after the day so after i do my skincare and open up the blinds get the natural light in what little there is at the moment because it's 7 a.m i normally wake up around 7 a.m on winter mornings then i make tea so i just grab a mug and i'm the type of person that makes tea in the microwave i know some people have opinions about that maybe i'll get like a cute little kettle but until then i'm not about to use the stove so i just fill it up with water and then i just put it in the microwave on winter mornings i feel like sometimes i'm pretty cold so i like having a nice warm drink in the morning and also i feel like my throat feels different in the winter than it does in the summer so i just need some type of tea to soothe it i've been loving green tea this one is from trader joe's it's just their caffeinated green tea and i normally don't add any sort of sweeteners to it or anything like that i more so drink it for the warm cheers and then i always make sure to fill up my water too I gotta stay hydrated i did have my humidifier on last night so i don't feel as dry as i normally do there's honestly nothing like the first sip of water in the morning next while my tea is brewing i like to do my journaling so this is my daily journal and this is this book called the daily stoic that i try to read every morning and basically it has a passage for every single day out of the year 366 meditations and each month is a different theme so january was clarity in february the month i'm in now is passions and emotions so it's just kind of some sort of philosophical quote so like it starts with the quote and then this passage is some sort of take on the quote for the modern world I find it really interesting It just kind of gives you a specific philosophical value to think about during the morning And if you do it every day, then you've gone through 366 passages, which I think is really cool On the weekends, I feel like sometimes I just totally forget to do it But I'm pretty good about doing it on the weekdays What is today's date though? I have like no idea Oh, it's Valentine's Day! It's the 14th! Oh my god, okay Why do I keep forgetting? Happy Valentine's Day! Or belated as you're watching this so february 14th it says for to be wise is only one thing to fix our attention on our intelligence which guides all things everywhere okay and then the little passage which helps kind of like understand what the quote is says why did i do that you've probably asked yourself we all have how could i have been so stupid what was i thinking oh my god me all the time you weren't that's the problem within that head of yours is all the reason and intelligence you need it's making sure that it's deferred to and utilized that's the tough part making sure that your mind is in charge not your emotions not your immediate physical sensations not your surging hormones okay interesting it's definitely easier said than done but in the context of the other passages this month it kind of makes sense because it's all just about like not losing your cool keeping a calm head being cool calm collected and not being hot-headed and it kind of gives different examples of how you can be more in control of your emotions so that you don't get like a temper or something like that obviously emotions are good everyone's supposed to feel sad anyway you did not come here for a philosophy lesson i'm not a philosopher i just like this book i think it's interesting so i thought i would show it to you guys and then i take this journal it's so cute and i start a new page at the top i just write the date 2-14 sometimes i like to write some sort of 
phrase from the Daily Stoic book. So today I'll just write cool, calm, collected. Calm, I said that weird. And then I write affirmations. And then I basically just write down a bunch of affirmations. So I write down kind of different things I'm striving for and kind of what I have going on today. So today I have a client call. I'm gonna write, I am confident. I am good at my job. I am great listener. It's just kind of like reaffirming the qualities about yourself that you want during the day. I am kind. It's Valentine's Day. I am a great girlfriend. And then I write more specific numerical goals that I write every single day. So I do that normally for my social media. So I'm like, I have 6K followers on Instagram because I actually just hit 5K. That's what I was writing before. And then it happened. This does seem really silly, but I don't know. I just like it. Any sort of numerical goal that you have or non-numerical goal, like if you want a new job, I have X job. I live in X city. If you're like working towards any sort of goal like that, just writing it down every morning. It just kind of reminds you of your goal, resets you, gets you excited and makes you believe that you can do it because I feel like that's the biggest thing. Vicente's is in the shower so you can kind of hear his music in the background. <laughs> oh, and the next I write the word grateful and then I write out a few things that I'm grateful for. So today I'm grateful for the sunshine. I am grateful for the flowers Vicente got me for Valentine's Day. I am grateful for my health. I start Accutane in a couple days. I was supposed to start it yesterday but then it was delayed a little bit. My blood work came back and the dermatologist said it was amazing. So I'm really grateful for my health and that I get to go work out this morning. Yeah, I just write some things I'm grateful for and it makes me in a good headspace for the day. All right, so that's my journaling. Now my tea is ready. So so that's really exciting. And now I'm gonna do some cleaning up before I'm gonna go get ready for yoga. I'm also gonna hop on a podcast. I love listening to podcasts in the morning while I'm going through my routine. It honestly really keeps me motivated. cleaning up now as a pre-yoga snack i'm gonna have a banana i've tried a million different things to eat pre-workout and i always go back to bananas i feel like it's the best thing at least for me i'm all ready for yoga this is my fit i'm just wearing full lululemon for workout sets my favorite brands are lulu and set active i'm obsessed with set active so that's pretty much all that i wear this is a sports bra i love the back and then these leggings the scuba neck lululemon hoodie it's so comfortable and i love that it zips because i can do my makeup in it i just i literally live in this hoodie i wear it all the time yeah so let's go to yoga i'm gonna run to the 8 a.m class which again i can only do that when i'm working from home because it ends at 8 50 and if i was trying to commute into the office that obviously would not be possible <laughs> okay let's go I'm back from yoga. It was really good. I did a vinyasa flow class and normally I don't sweat so much, but I'm really, really sweating. So I'm gonna hop in the shower super quick. And then after that, I'm gonna make a quick breakfast. Sometimes after I work out in the mornings, I'll make myself a protein shake. I'm not today because it was vinyasa flow versus like bar or burn or something more weight heavy or cardio heavy. But this is the protein powder I normally use. It's Vega plant-based protein powder. It tastes really good. It has greens in it too. Okay, let's hop in the shower. <laughs> Served. I am logging on to my work laptop, checking my emails, eating my gluten-free Trader Joe's everything bagel with avocado on top. It's literally the best breakfast in the world and probably the highlight of my day. I reheated up my tea. I've started just making coffee in the afternoons or going to get coffee in the afternoons. So I have the tea in the morning and then coffee in the afternoon because I feel like I kind of get into an afternoon slump and it just kind of helps me pick me up. And like right now I feel great. I'm post-workout, I have a lot of energy. So I don't really need coffee. So I try to just like listen to my body to see if I actually need to <laughs> consume caffeine. Yeah, so I'm just gonna check my emails, eat my breakfast, perks of working from home. I'm still in my robe. I'll probably end up getting ready during my lunch break. That's really my work from home morning routine. Thanks so much for watching. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for a new video every Sunday and Wednesday. It was fun hanging out with you guys. Let me know what you like to do in the mornings. I always love hearing like what other people's morning routine is. It's super inspiring and we can just inspire each other in the comments. Yeah, sending all of you guys the love. I hope you had an amazing Valentine's Day and I will see you in my next video. Bye!